and welcome to my studio and today we're going to be doing a beginner version of my Star Wars Cantina dance. Now this is a dance that I did for Inktober, the word was Dune, and all I could think was Tatooine. Like all I could think. So I decided to make a dance to that and everyone loved it so much they asked for a tutorial but I know that some people would prefer a beginner tutorial, so I decided to kind of modify the dance to be more suitable for beginners and lower level intermediate. I would say this is advanced beginner, just because it has a couple of quick moves in it, but everything's worth a try, so go ahead and try it. And the worst that happens is you can always slow down the YouTube video. Please do that when I'm not talking, like when the dance is just happening, because I feel like I might sound scary if my voice gets slowed down. Or do it and you know it's Halloween month whatever it can be scary so yeah anyway we are doing the cantina theme and if you're not subscribed to this channel already please please subscribe because I just want to see this tap family grow and it's growing so much every day and I love it so much and also hit that thumbs up button if you like Star Wars just so other Star Wars fans that also tap can find this and learn this dance so hit that thumbs up button but without any more Jabbering from me? Is that the word? <laughs> Yammering? Let's get started. Okay, so um, you have dig step, dig step, dig step, stamp. So it starts with three dig steps and a stamp. One, two, three, stamp. So just right, left, right, stamp. Five, six, seven, go. Right, left, right, stamp. Now this song is very fast. So make sure that everything you're doing is very low to the ground and also kind of relaxed. Don't be like, don't lift up your legs too high because you're not gonna be able to keep up with the speed. So keep it nice and relaxed, chill, as tap dancers should be. So dig step, dig step, dig step, stand. Five, six, seven, eight. One, and two, and three, and four. Then you have two paradiddles. Dig, dig, step, step, dig, step. And before I go any further, if there are any steps that we do that you're still working on that you need more help with or that you haven't learned yet, like if you haven't learned a buffalo, there's some buffaloes in here, um, I have step tutorials in a playlist linked in the description. So make sure that you click that, find the video of the step that you're looking for. These are videos that are dedicated to a specific step. So find that video, work on the step, and then you can always just come back to this video later. Cool? All right, so you had Dig step, dig step, dig step, stamp. Two paradiddles. Dig step, step, build, dig step, stamp. So let's do that together. Five, six, seven, go. Dig step, dig step, dig step, stamp. Five, and six, and seven, and eight. One more time. Five, six, seven, go. One, and two, and three, and stamp. Dig step, step, build, dig step, stamp. Then, you do it all again, except instead of paradiddles, you have shuffle step heel. So you have big step, big step, big step, step, two shuffle step heels. So it's like a paradiddle, but instead of big stank step heel, you're doing shuffle step. So let's try that. Three big steps in a stamp, two shuffle step heels. Five, six, seven, eight. Big step, big step, big step. One more time. Five, six, seven, go. Big step, big step, big step, step. Short, big step, short, step, 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 step. So let's do those two together. So dig step, dig step, dig step, stamp, two paradiddles. Dig step, dig step, dig step, stamp, two shuffled step heels. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Alright, so 
let's try it from the top and then we will do it with music. Five, six, seven, eight. Big step, big step, big step, step. Parabiddle, parabiddle. Big step, big step, big step, step. Shuffle, step, no three bubble ups. Okay. So we're going to wait one whole phrase and then start, which is why there's only three sections of that. But let's try it. Let's try it from the beginning. <laughs> it's kind of fast, so just be prepared, okay? Hold 
Then you have shuffle, step, heel, shuffle, step, heel, shuffle, step, heel, stamp. So you have three of them. When I said stamp, I meant ball change. <laughs> shuffle, step, heel, shuffle, step, heel, shuffle, step, heel, ball. My bad. It's a ball change. So you just did your last one. Your left foot was free. This is why you start left with your shuffle step heels. One and two and three and four and five and six and seven. So let's add that to the cramp roll section and then we'll add it to the whole thing with music, okay? So cramp rolls. Five, six, seven, eight. Hold one, hold three. You know, try to improve one transition because that's really the hardest part. So let's do it. So one more time just to solidify it in our legs and then we'll do the last part because we're almost done. So you're reaching with a dig, a 
I do these in a lot of my beginner dances. Um, so you reach for the dig, you step heel behind, you reach with another dig, and then you touch, you don't put any weight on it, and then you go this way. Dig, step, step, heel, dig, step, step. Now this is pretty quick, so as you guys are doing it with the music, if getting the articulations of dig, step, step, heel is too fast, is too difficult, just do a regular grapevine. but then practice and work your way toward adding those articulations. But to get through the dance, just do regular grapevine. That's fine. So you have grapevine, one, eight, two, and three, and four, five, and six, and seven, eight. Now you have options, because <laughs> I know not everyone likes to turn. Technically, it's step, heel, step, heel, step, heel, step. So your legs are going step, heel, step, heel, step. And if you just want to do that without turning, totally fine. You do not have to turn. So you have step, heel, step, heel, step, heel, step, and put all of your weight on that. Or you have step, heel, step, heel, step, heel, step, and put all of your weight on that. And then everybody goes stamp, stamp, chug, slide. So five, six, seven, eight. Okay? So you have great vine. Great five. Turn or don't, and then stamp, stamp, chug, slap. So try that slow with me. Five, six, seven, eight. Dig, step, step, heel, dig, step, touch. Dig, step, step, heel, dig, step, touch. Step, heel, step, heel, step, heel, step, step, stamp, stamp, chug, chug. Do that again. Try not to travel too much on the turn, especially if you're not turning. Try to hit like the middle of your board. So try that again. From grapevine. Five, six, seven, eight. Big step, step, go, big step, touch. Big step, step, go, big step, touch. Step, go, step, go, step, go, big step. Stamp, stamp, jump, spot. So let's do that a tiny bit faster. Five, six, seven, eight. Then you do it again. You do almost all of it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. And instead of stamp, stamp, chug, slide, you're gonna do tramp, roll, ball, chug. And that's the end of the piece. So you do the grapevine, the grapevine, and then the turn or the not turn. And then you have step, step, roll, roll, ball, chug. So it's a slower crimp roll than we did earlier. Five and six and seven, eight. Okay? So let's do all of the grapevine stuff. Let's just put it together. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Big step, step, kill, big step, catch. Big step, step, kill, big step, catch. Step, kill, step, kill, step, kill, step. Stamp, stamp, kill, kill, slide. Big step, step, kill, big step, catch. Big step, step, kill, big step, catch. Step, kill, step, kill, step, kill, step. Step, step, kill, kill, ball. It's a lot, right? But it's very repetitive. So just remembering the first time you do the stamp, stamp, chug, slide, the second time you do a crimp roll. So let's try it one more time. Five, six, seven, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Step, go, step, go, step, go, step, stamp, stamp, chug, great, fine. And turn. Can we just walk through from the top? Let's walk through from the top and then we'll try it with music. All right, so from dig step, we've got the dig step section, the cramp roll section, and the grapevine section. Okay? So let's try the beginning. All the way through. Five, six, seven, eight. Dig step, dig step, dig step, stamp, terror. Do it again. This time we shuffle. Three. Parallel ball, change. Shuffle, step, go, shuffle, step, go, 
we did it. And if you need to rewind any of that, you absolutely can. But let's try it with music. I have a feeling we are going to do just fine. But first time never counts. one of those mistakes. Okay? Let's try it again. below and if for some reason I forgot to link it you just, just go to my channel it'll be right there they're coming out on the same day I'm trying to do that where if I do a song I'll try to do like multiple versions because I think I did a song I don't remember which one I, I think it was Havana and I did like a beginner version and everyone's like can you do an advanced version that's like oh man I totally didn't think about that so now I have to revisit an old song and make an advanced version versus if I just do it off the bat, if I pick a song to do or you guys request a song, I'll just make multiple levels. It'll be fine. And that way it's more accessible to all of you, which is the entire point of this YouTube channel. Very accessible, free tap dance classes. Ta-da! <laughs> With a nerdy theme sometimes because I'm a giant nerd. If you can't tell by the Iron Man and War Machine ballerinas and the Wally, I am a huge nerd. So I never will shy away from doing something like super, super geeky. <laughs> but yeah, 
please subscribe, join the TAP fam, enjoy these tutorials. I've got tons, as I said. Hit the thumbs up button so other people can find this video a little bit easier. And yeah, as always, thank you for dancing with me and may the force be with you.